when it comes to prayer, um, the Bible is very, very serious about it. In fact, you're going to see over and over and over again in the New Testament, this theme began to be developed. And, and in the New Testament, the scriptures also acknowledge that prayer is difficult. Paul says, labor with me in prayer. Isn't that an interesting choice of words? Work with me at prayer. It, it's almost as if the apostles acknowledging, hey, it doesn't come easy for most of us. So labor with me, work with me, sweat with me in prayer. The Bible says to pray without ceasing, okay? So that that amen that we say is a so be it, not an ending to our dialogue with God Almighty. Rejoice in hope, persevere in tribulation, be devoted to prayer. Ephesians 6, 18, pray at all times in the spirit with all perseverance, with all devotion. Devote yourself to prayer, be watchful in prayer, continue in, be steadfast in prayer. Isaiah 62, 6-7 says this, On your walls, O Jerusalem, I, God Almighty, have appointed watchmen. All day and all night they will never keep silent. You who remind the Lord, take no rest for yourselves and give me no rest until He, God the Father, establishes and makes Jerusalem a praise in the earth. So God loves being bothered by his children so much that he literally appoints people to bother him. Did, did you hear it in the text? Give me no rest. Don't stop asking me. Don't stop petitioning me. Don't stop begging me until Jerusalem is established. In this, God's saying, listen, he's saying, bother me. Uh, bother me, pester me, all right? Keep knocking on my door. Give me no rest until I answer you. All right, so this is once again the same. Not only has he ordained that we should ask him, but he delights in the asking. It's James 4.2. You desire and you do not have, so you murder. You covet and cannot obtain, so you fight and quarrel. Listen to this. You do not have because you do not ask. Is it not an implication of this text that if you did ask, you would have? Luke 11, 9 through 10. This is red letter. Jesus said this. And I tell you, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and it will be opened to you. For everyone who asks receives. And the one who seeks finds. And to the one who knocks, the door will be opened to you. 